We want to talk about the issues that preceded uh, the 2020 general elections. There was the voter registration exercise. Mm. Well, you came up against uh, on the side of the MPP. I think the MCE for us. Yeah. 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 Yes, and then, I mean, the registration exercise we saw yeah. on the news, the issues mm. that came up. What was it for you? Having done politics all this, well, I, when you I, sat I, back, I, what I, did you see was happening? I, I could see clearly mm. there was a grand plan to read this 2020 election. But you see, when you are in a, in a group, and I always tell my peers, like those in the uh, Volta region, mm. and those in uh, say some part of Northern region, some of the uh, are strongholds. I said, you, you, you just go through a, a family uh, battle. Mm. You don't really go through a fight. Yeah. We do. Because where I sit as a small city, if I blink, I'm gone. Well, look, I'm surrounded by six constituencies. Mm. Kwaburi East, that will win with a margin of over 70,000. Mm -hmm. Ejusu, that will win with a margin of over 50,000. Mm. Ofurukrom, that will win with a margin of over 30,000. Subin, that will win with a margin of over 30,000. Yeah. And Menshia North and Menshia South. It goes without saying. And, I mean, you are Kumasi people, you are, you are Americans. <laughs> <laughs> and you just cross. You, yeah. don't, you don't need to be bass. Yeah. You don't need to be, I mean, it's just, I mean, if you know the terms so. Yeah. Yeah. The streets. Mm -hmm. Is there between Aswanze and Menshe? Yeah. So. Yeah. I get the name. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You just walk across. Just walk. Yeah. yeah. And my view was that, I mean, they are not here to maybe defend themselves. They had hatched a scheme mm -hmm. to do heavy importing of people mm -hmm. into Aswanze. I mean, if you look at the circumstances of me becoming a member of parliament, mm -hmm. I mean, my people have done so much for me. I mean, who, are, who, who am I? Montaka, Montaka. I mean, I believe if I were one of the richest persons from Asmasi, my name would not be where <laughs> it is today. Mm -hmm. so if they've given me this opportunity, by way of electing me again, again, and again, and at any point in time, they decide that, no, we've had enough of you, want to change, I should still be thanking them. Yeah. I don't have to be them. Mm -hmm. But you see the scheme is not to use the people of Asmasi mm -hmm. to remove me, but to bring people who do not even know Aswansi yeah. to remove me, that was the, the problem. Mm. You wanted to twist and virtually destroy our democracy. Mm. And then you win your election yeah. amongst your other colleagues. Yeah. And so you are in parliament yes. on the um, 6th of January. Yeah. Yeah. What happened? What meeting went on? Who brought the idea <laughs> that let us go to parliament at 9 p.m. when the whole thing was supposed to happen around but, midnight? But is, is it true you, you guys lodged at a particular hotel? Yeah, what happened? Well, let me, let me say, I mean, the WHIP's office uh -huh. consists of two deputies. Yeah. And then every, every WHIP worth it mm. knows the strength and the weakness of every member of his caucus. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I couldn't rely on the new ones who were coming because yeah. I didn't really know many of them. Mm. But I had the continuous MP and I was 74 of that. And I needed to have a group mm. that will help the WHIP's office to execute this. Yeah. And that's why I was telling my colleagues, that, look, whilst we were planning and organizing and strategizing, they were just rattling and threatening their members. <laughs> Instead of them to plan and strategize. Yeah. Yeah. And I believe that the day was won by those who plan, mm -hmm. organize, and strategize. Mm -hmm. And that was us. So we had, I had, we had this group mm -hmm. that even the leader doesn't, cannot tell who were, they were. Mm -hmm. It was only me, my deputies, mm -hmm. and them. Okay. So nobody else knew. Mm -hmm. So all we say is that, look, when the day comes, everybody, yours is to listen to the whip. Okay. Mm. You are older than me. Some of you are my seniors in parliament. Mm. Some of you have children my age. Yeah. But on the sixth mm. to the seventh, mm. everybody, including the leader, will have to take instructions from the whip. Okay. Mm. We had five objectives. Mm -hmm. The first objective was that they are refusing to talk to us mm. okay. because they believe they have wanted to age. Mm. We need to prove to them that going into this parliament, we need to be talking to each other. Mm. Yeah. That's the only way we can get government to run. Yeah. But it starts from tonight. Mm. Yeah. 
and we must beat them to it. And I will tell you, four days before the day, mm -hmm. our party and us have not decided that we will contest a speaker. Mm. Okay. Because we're hoping that they were going to reach out. Okay. So that we could use the reaching out as a beginning to maybe call for the first deputy speaker. Mm. Mm. And they were not, because obviously they were arrogant about it and they were Because they felt they were an outright majority. Out. So the whole idea was <laughs> to frustrate the inauguration. Look, we wanted them to, uh, no, we wanted them to appreciate that we were a force to reckon with. Okay. That in this parliament, uh -huh. you could not just run over this minority yeah. and think that it will be business as usual. Mm. Mm. So if we're going for it, I have to work a strategy mm. for a possible win. Mm -hmm. So I started infiltrating their camp. And whips have deep, 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 deep ears. Mm. So now I pick their list. Who and who that I know are heads on their side? Mm. Whether from their primaries mm. or from them not being given ministerial position mm -hmm. or the party has done something to them. Mm -hmm. So I itemized all that and I had 35. Mm. So I had to now engage every single one, one of the 35. You did that? Yes. But did you look at those who had problems with the then speaker? All of them. I, I, when I'm talking about they have problems, mm. it is having problem with either the president, yeah. having problem with either the party, party. or having problem with the speaker, speaker, or having problem with the majority leader. Some way, somehow, you are not happy. You exactly. are not happy. Yeah. Yeah. You are just not happy. Yeah. So I then and you 35. And I have 35. Wow. wow. And I started reaching out. And believe me, and I'm sure my party leaders, if they are listening, <laughs> they, will, they will laugh at this. At the point, I almost gave up. Because after meeting almost like 20, it's like, ah, Montega, what are you asking for? Hey, this is a tall order. Yeah. Mm -hmm. No, it cannot be. It's true. Hey, look, my party will find out. Mm -hmm. And they will skin me alive. <laughs> so was that so why? So after that, about yeah. the 20th mm -hmm. person, it was like, no. This, one this is a mission impossible. Mm -hmm. So we came to me and said, look, if you are not reaching out, why not also reach out? No, 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 no. Why must we reach out? I mean, we are already down. Yeah. We don't fear falling. Mm -hmm. So, okay. Then give me some three, four days more. Then the three, four days produce a magic. Wow. Because when you are talking to somebody who is uh -huh. hurt, mm -hmm. and he's telling you straight, no, 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 this is not possible. Please, I mean, I can't get involved. You, you outright lose hope. Mm -hmm. But you're talking to someone, you try to say, hmm, I think it's true. Hmm. <laughs> but he's not saying anything. Mm -hmm. it There's gives you of some hope that you can yeah. push. <laughs> so now, from 35, I zero down to 5. Mm. Mm -hmm. So I went to a meeting and I said, yeah, look, I'll shock you guys, I'll produce, a, I'll produce a speaker. Oh, please. I said, well, I'll shock you, I'll produce a speaker. I mean, what do you mean? I said, all I need is to have my 137 intact. If I can keep all my 137 yeah. intact, I will shock all of you. I'll produce a speaker. Mm. So you know, what kind of person do we then put forward? We need to put in someone who had been in the house for long, mm -hmm. who generally members have respect. Yeah. So. Who has friends too. Because once you stay in the house for long, you have friends on both sides. Yeah. So that people know he may not be too antagonistic. Mm. Yeah. So we talk, oh, this person, that person, this person, then the party settled on Barbie. Okay. But who, who are some of the names that came up? Why should I be telling you this? <laughs> 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 who are some of the names that came up? Whose name came up again? Came up, okay. But we juggle and then we settle on mm. Barbie. Yeah. Then I, 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 I spoke to him. I said, I mean, you know, I've been his whip yeah. Yeah. as a leader. I want you to have confidence that you are going to win this. He looked at me. Sure. I said, yes. The, be, we, the victory starts with you. Mm -hmm. yeah. You having the conviction that yeah. you, you are going be. to win. Did he initially want to reject it? Because we know he was packing bag and Yeah, he was packing. He was packing. He In fact, start, all this uh, discussion two weeks mm -hmm. before then, yeah. Yeah. I was doing with him. What okay. strategy we should adopt? Mm. What, because he's been my leader. I've yeah. been his whip. And you know, one of the longest serving. Yeah. Yeah. So he has very experience. Maybe you should do this. Or maybe, why not do that? Why not do that? He never thought mm. it was never, coming to his doorstep. He didn't know that all was, the things yeah. will finally. That's why sometimes when something is happening, contribute positively. Yeah. Because, I mean, you, you may not know. know. You may you be doing it for yourself. Be the beneficiary. Yeah. So he did. 
I started this the two weeks that mm. I'm constantly talking to him. Yeah. The final one, the thing came to his lap. I said that, but if you convince yourself you win, you also have to get up and start working. Yeah. Mm. Can you talk to this person? Talk to that person. Talk to that person. You know, remember I've told you I've told you five. five. No. So, the, so the five people you had your short list. The, the five people <laughs> yeah. are they? Known people, mm -hmm. I mean, popular people in you the NPP. No, I'm not saying mention. <laughs> no, I'm not saying mention names. <laughs> but you know, people we know, and these people that we yeah. know that should their names come out, we'll be shocked. I won't give you that. No, are they popular people? I'm not saying mention their names. I won't give you that. Clue. Are they popular people? Because you see, the, the, the reason I won't give you that clue mm -hmm. is that there are a lot of acquisition going on. Yeah. And I look at the list that they are getting, and I laugh in my head. But they are yeah. popular but people. If I give a clue, I'll be betraying oh, no, their trust. Yeah. This yeah. were done under a lot of trust. Mm -hmm. And yeah. look, let me believe me. There was the oath of secrecy. There was this thing about national interest. Mm -hmm. I think that trick worked for me. Okay. I said, look, believe me. It's not because you are hurt. With this kind of parliament. If we have a speaker that can help us to oversight the government, yeah. it will lead to the benefit of the whole country. Yeah. Yeah. Just see that contribution of yours in that light, mm -hmm. not your head. Mm -hmm. That if you get a speaker that can help this house mm. to oversight the executive properly, mm. this country will be better off. Mm. Yeah. My next question, <laughs> I want us to see you know, pictures of what happened in Parliament yes. that night. Mm -hmm. Papers. Someone has taken the uncounted ballot papers. Is that Carlos Ahinkra? No, no, no. Yeah, Carlos. That's Carlos Ahinkra, isn't it, of Tema West? And uh, he's been attacked. Um, I, am, I am not sure, but that looks so much like it is Carlos Ahinkra. Won by two extra ballots. The MPP side is as dead as a grave. Uh, I do not understand why uh, this uh, would be happening. <laughs> All right, so uh, have no, you seen these no, videos no, before? No, no, have you watched them? No. Oh, you haven't. <laughs> but did you see yourself in there? No, did you see yourself no, in there? No, no, because no, at a point, no. you were diving, no. you were flying, you know, to just... Mm -hmm. Is it because of the strategy you had? That is yeah. why you were strictly preventing the NPP side from showing their votes out? You know, let me, let me, let me say, I mean... I mean, we owe this, the people of this country an apology. Yeah. No, oh, for that yeah, you no, do. No, that you do. We owe yeah. people, we, no, this cannot be right. Maybe you yeah. can apologize on no, behalf no, of all no, of them. No, we will no, accept no, on behalf no, of Ghanaians. No, I think, uh, Parliament, we can do better than this. Mm. I mean, this is very humiliating. Yeah. We can't, okay. we can't, people cannot queue from morning to evening to elect us to come and be doing this. I'm really very sorry. I mean, I'm sad what, what I've seen. Apology that, uh, accepted. This chaotic yeah. thing. No, no, I mean, we, should, we could have been more decent yeah. than it is. And now people are saying that, oh, but I'm going to get that day. Uh, you, were, you were violent. My apologies. I really wish it didn't get there. I mean, with the chaotic day I've seen. Did you give Carlos Ahinkwa some blues? <laughs> I don't even remember. Now you are saying, oh my it's goodness. It's not going to be a movie. Oh my goodness. Yeah. I mean, you, uh, and we were bashing you on social media, yeah, all yeah. of you. Yeah, yeah. That was, I mean, what we did was not right. Yeah. All of us were wrong. And I really wish this never happened. Mm -hmm. But you see, now they have planned, mm -hmm. they will break the law. Mm -hmm. I go to complain to the clerk, who in this was the chair. And it's like, he's not capable of doing anything. Must I allow the law to be broken? I know that I'm clothed with the People's uh, Representative Act. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That says that the electoral officer, the clerk, the candidate, or their agent mm. have a responsibility of ensuring that the ballot is secret. Yeah. Mm. If I have a clerk who can order his marshal to do ensure that is not doing it mm. and sitting down helpless mm -hmm. and the first person goes to vote then he shows i tried to tell him that no once we've shown it i won't allow you to put it in yeah. the box mm -hmm. it, then it becomes, there's a scaffold yeah then everybody oh he showed it so that one nullify 
we should start over again. He goes to vote again. He still shows it. I don't want to have a scaffold with him. Mm -hmm. So I picked the box to the chair. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Remember, I'm also an electoral officer at yeah. that time. Mm -hmm. Based yeah. on the law. Yeah. I'm part because I'm an agent. Mm -hmm. Look, take the box. He won't put it in because he has showed it. He's yeah. breaking the law. Yeah. That's what I did. Mm -hmm. Then another scaffold happened. Then the third time, he tried to still show it. That's yeah. when others went up and yeah. started booting the the, the boots and, boot and all. Then now we have to now do what yeah. we failed to do from the beginning. Which was? To go into conclave mm -hmm. and talk. Yeah. Now we went into conclave and we had to agree yeah. on the do's and the don'ts. Okay. And when we came back, there was harmony okay. for the process to go. Mm -hmm. That this process will never go on mm -hmm. unless it is by secret because mm -hmm. that is constitutional, yeah. that is supported by our standard orders. Mm -hmm. We should be seen respecting, not even if not uh, standing orders, mm. the constitution. Mm -hmm. So we cannot be seen breaking the law. Yeah. yeah. So we all agree and then come back and they have to abandon their, their, the showing their, their showing. Yeah. Yeah. And once they were showing, it was a double edged sword. Because remember, they were also infiltrating my camp. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And I had seven people that I, I had my doubts. Mm, from them. your camp. <laughs> yes. You also had your Judas's. <laughs> because they also have concerns. Of course. Mm -hmm. Just as this who has concerns, they were yeah. not being talked mm -hmm. to. Mm -hmm. I now use that as a, say, hey, now I'm talking to those who have concerns, they are not being listened to. What about my dad? Exactly. Yeah. I'm not talking to. So mm -hmm. I started talking to them. And I did not only stop there. I got a party hierarchy mm -hmm. to talk to them individually. Okay. To tell Is that them all what to talking to. Oh, or no. you had to go the extra mile no, to bring no. some pounds. No. No, that one, and I mm. and I say it, and that's why I felt very offended. Because the, the rumor mill has been very, very busy after well, that after night. After the rumor mill, it was there. Mm. But the bottom line was that we needed to get people to talk to them, to appreciate what was at stake, mm. and those concerns that they had. I'm the whip. Yeah. We are doing the committee. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You could be, it could be managed. I mean, yeah. the last time I was not put on this committee, and I was not this. We can deal with all this, yeah. but for now, let's go into this thing as a united group. Mm. Yeah. Even in worst scenario, mm -hmm. that we don't get the speaker. Yeah. I wanted to seven must stand. Yeah. yeah. To mean that we are together. We are together. So I managed to get that before the day. But that <laughs> might not be bad for Carlos. Yeah. We saw what he did, yes. mm -hmm. and we saw you also flying. Yeah. You know. <laughs> because I couldn't imagine all my twelve going to a dance. <laughs> yeah. Because you see, when we sorted, I mean, I heard this. Oh, we're not sorted. You are not there. Yeah. Who were there? You know, usually they will applaud all the content of the box. Yeah. Then I suggested, and the whip opposite agreed. This is not 1,000 votes. This is not 500. This is not 700. This is 275. Mm. Can we leave the ballot in the box and pick them yeah. one by one? So yeah. we'll be sorting. Yeah. So by the time we pick the last one out, we know we'll where, have sorted. Yeah. Yeah. And we'll be counting to make sure that it is 275. Yeah. Yeah. So as we pick, we're not only sorting them, but we're Counting making sure that well. yeah, the, 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 there was no double. Mm -hmm. yeah. I mean, so, and we had this. Now we have a hip, this hip, that hip, and then there was one. That one, I was, I did risk, because it was for Barbie. Mm. You know, Barbie was nominated first. Yeah. And you know, we had a lot of elderly people among us. I want to believe that the person was sleepy. Mm -hmm. So when he went, because Barbie was nominated first. He thought he'd be number one. Okay. So after he voted, then he realized, no, no, number one is Professor Margaret Quay. Ah. So the person canceled. Yeah. With and now head. voted right. Mm. So and you can see clearly the intention. Yeah. It is not that the person ticked here and ticked there. No. Oh, okay. The person. But then it becomes a sports by the not. Sports, isn't it? Okay. But the intention is very clear. Mm. Well, but then the intention is not what is represented. No, I mean, the, the translation the then is, very, is a sports ballot, person isn't canceled, it? Because you could see that he ticked. Mm. He or she ticked yeah. and then cancelled mm. and then ticked here. The so I thought that the intention is very clear. Yeah. But it was becoming because obviously it was obviously for, they for, won't for me. Obviously, they won't agree. Then my daughter said, Show it to me. <laughs> ah, I'm going to take this one. I said, By the intention, oh, I said, Fine. Just put it as well. Mm. So we kept it as well. Now I wanted to count that of Babin first. But I see, whilst we were there, my brother and colleague, mm. I know don't pray, were mm -hmm. talking. And, and we're discussing how we can work together mm. and those things. So I thought that I needed to show the first goodwill. Mm. So 
because he was holding that of Professor Kwe. Yeah. Okay. I wasn't holding anything. Okay. It was uh, our clerk, Jetro, mm -hmm. who was holding that of Babin. So I wanted to say, since you are holding that of Michael Kwe, let me count this one mm -hmm. yeah. first. Then we can count yours, because you are holding yours. Yes. I'm not holding mine. Yeah. But I said, oh, let's count this one. I said, mm -hmm. okay, no problem. Let's count. Yeah. So we counted, and it was 136. Mm. Mm -hmm. So then why I need 136? <laughs> if I had even the small one to read. Mission accomplished. So I gave my people. Yeah, too sure. <laughs> <laughs> so how did, you, how did you feel after that? No, I, I, was, I, was, I was really, I can't describe how I was feeling. Mm. Yeah. But for the avoidance mm. of doubt, mm. I just wanted us to count yeah. and yeah. finish.